Hey guys, Vegas Romaniac, let me show you where's my mailbox. Why? It's because I'm waiting for a set of handlebar razors and as everything else in this world, uh, this stuff comes from the internet. That magical place where you put an order and it kind of shows up a couple of days later to your house, saves you drive time and gas and headaches to buy them from a local store. So if you don't think that Amazon is killing jobs in this country, you're absolutely wrong because it does for sure and that's my house that's my crib that's where I live and this must be my package in my mail this has to be my package and that's my neighbor with his Jeep And this is my house. That's my trailer that I camp with, and that's my palm tree, and that's my other palm tree, and that's my dead tree, and it's a random bush that is growing over there, and this is my super duper car, and these are my handlebar razors, which are supposed to be universal, so if they're not universal, I'm gonna be very, very fucking pissed. I'm gonna be very, very, very fucking pissed. But they were supposed to be universal, so. <sighs> Drop some shit on the floor. So let's see how this works. Hmm, they look like they're gonna fit. They look like they're gonna fit. I think they're upside down, so they can install this way. Okay, that makes sense. And uh, all this magic is gonna happen with a number, with a number 10, right? I've never installed this before, this is the first time I'm doing it, so don't expect to get advice. Even though maybe I will name this video how to install handlebar razors, I might not be qualified to give such advice. So I'm gonna take these off. There's four bolts that hold this thing entire place together. The handlebars are already moving. Okay, let's see why is it not coming off. Oh, I know. It's because my motorcycle <laughs> My motorcycle is attached to the handlebars to the table, but because I'm doing the uh, Handlebars right the idiot in me forgot to tighten it over here. So it doesn't fall off So what I'll have to do is I'll have to get it tight on the back wheel so that way, when the handlebars come off, the motorcycle still stands, right? Let's see. Because that should be a pretty good trick in the book. So that way, I could take these off. They were pulling on my handlebars and they were making me look like an idiot right and now we are installing handlebar razors because for a second something was pulling really hard on my handlebars and I didn't know what okay so we're gonna have to reuse this part in the process so these two pieces will have to be reused but we're not gonna reuse these bolts And this is the bar that was supposed to fit there. $17 on Amazon. And this was supposed to fit right under the handlebar. And the handlebar is supposed to go over it and hmm, looks pretty good. I don't know if they're really worth it, but I'm trying to correct my riding position. So. Let's see, the bolts come out. I'm gonna have to use those because these are too short. And then raise this side of the handlebars. Okay. So far, it was not hard. Even a caveman can do it. And then there is a washer over here. I'm not sure what's the purpose of the washer. 
Um, it's maybe some kind of like a spacer. Guess what? It fits. Beautiful. Beautiful. And my cable seems to be long enough since I flipped them upside down because I have to flip them upside down over here on the throttle. Not sure if I had to or not, but everybody said that I have to, so I kind of like prepared them. So, okay, these are not lining up. Okay, now, now they're lined up. And now I'm gonna get my other piece and then I'm gonna get the first in the second one don't get them tight as that's just a normal rule don't get them tight because they might not be aligned properly let's see how long we're gonna have to look for a allen wrench not that long man i'm pretty good today i'm on fire uh, for those that ask i like to ride mine at plus two as you can see there's a plus two over here that keeps me uh, a more in attack position so I like to stay in plus two. I'll have to move my uh, my computer. Seems to be in the way a bit. Dogs are fighting on my street. Okay, something is holding it. There it is. Okay, okay now. No, 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 it's too much. I'm trying to put the handlebar so I'm not riding more on one side and less on the other. There you go. So they're lined up now, see? Maybe a little bit this way. There it is. Okay, and as I said, I'm riding at plus two. That's the highest position. The reason I'm riding in a more aggressive position is that I like, uh, I'm tall. And that's the tallest that the handlebars can get. So, also I'm trying to space them out. I'm also trying to space them out. Oh, that was my neighbor on the BMW who just uh, drove by. So if you see yourself in the video, write me a comment. Uh, but I'm trying to space them out properly. Okay, they are spaced out properly. Get them nice and tight. I would prefer to be a socket in the in top, not Allen wrench, but Allen wrench will do, it seems. <sighs> nice and tight. All four of them. Man, this was really easy to install. I hope they're not gonna come in my hands. <laughs> oh, that sounds nasty. Come in my hands. But I hope they're not gonna let the handlebars go in my hands. But this should have corrected my um, riding position. I lost one of the bolts already. Son of a bitch, I'll find it. But that should correct my riding position, so let me reattach these and see if this actually makes a difference. Uh, do I feel that the bike is higher? Let's see. Does it feel better? Well, it's definitely higher, that's for sure. Yeah, you could definitely feel. Oops. Come on, table. Hold my things together. Okay, there you go. So, yeah, I could definitely. Oh, ah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, this has definitely made a difference. That definitely made a difference. Okay, oh, well, we have handlebar hair razors now. We have handlebar razors. <laughs>